Woohoo! Just got to the end of the second day of official bagging and uh, we've got one complete layer on the entire house. So we just pumped it from eight till five and uh, it's just working really, really well. Over here we got <coughs> the internal walls, which are starting to be the subdivided walls and uh, really, really well laid. There's a beautiful curve to them and we have two complete layers all the way on the outside. Yeah, we're bagging it. We're bagging it, baby! <laughs> The shoot worked incredibly well. I've got a little bit of footage of that. I'll chuck some more up later. The shoot worked very, very well. And uh, yeah, the consistency of the mix is great. Comes out really light and really fluffy. So uh, yeah, really, really happy with just everyone and how everything's worked. So go team. Morning, everyone. We're at the second day of week two and uh, we've just been absolutely smashing it. Really, really, really happy with the team. Everyone's picked it up super quick and uh, everyone's just really self-focused. They can uh, run pretty much most of the build by themselves. Uh, everyone's just jumping on jobs before I need to tell them. So uh, it's just a really, really good feeling when the whole team really knows what's going on. Um, where We've just done the fifth layer on the inside. Um, so in about six days work, we've done, um, started the fifth layer. So four complete layers and started the fifth. Um, behind me is the um, internal single wall. And then over here we've got uh, double thickness walls for the outside, mainly so that we can uh, really safely berm uh, the entire building, especially here, up against the retaining wall. Um, this retaining wall is pretty extreme and uh, it really needs to support a, a lot of weight. So, yeah, everything's coming up really well. We've got about 2% cement in it and about 1% lime. So the lime will take a bit longer to set up and uh, the cement's a little bit quicker. So, yeah, everything's just going really well. All of our forms are holding up incredibly well the uh, big hobbit door it was um, pretty tricky to tamp these lower rows because um, the door goes like that and curves inwards so it was really quite hard to get a tamp in there and we made this um, made this really funky 45 degree angle tamp which goes in like this sits in like there and then you whack it with a hammer. So that was made up by one of the workshoppers, really, really good idea. And uh, yeah, our shoot's been working really wonderfully behind there, just pump stuff out. All the amazing uh, excavators and bobcat contraptions are really, really good. So yeah, everything's just going great. Hopefully the rain stays away and we've just got another five days of bag and then that's it. Awesome, thanks heaps. And that's it. Uh, we've come to the end of our two-week workshop and uh, in a lot of spaces we're up to 10 rows up, 9 to 10 layers up and uh, yeah we just had a huge day today. I'm sunburnt, I'm exhausted but I'm so happy. Everyone's just worked so well and yeah I couldn't really be much more thankful. It looks beautiful, uh, all the rows are just lovely and really clean and everybody just knew exactly what to do when they needed to do it and I didn't even need to ask them by the end so it's just really beautiful everything's super solid and um, yeah just really really thankful for the experience and it was a beautiful time so thanks everybody who was involved thanks Will and Kenny for keeping the mix team running up the top and just pumping us heaps of really great mix throughout the week throughout the two weeks um, yeah so thanks for watching and we'll do a lot more videos like this. Bye-bye.